Two days after President Tinubu transmitted to the National Assembly the proposed amendments to the 2024 Appropriation Act to make room for key infrastructure projects and the national minimum wage, the lawmakers are engaging the Minister of Budget and National Planning for details. Atiku Bagudu explains that the review is part of President Tinubu's resolve to confront infrastructure deficit, which is why projects such as the Lagos Calabar, the Trans Sahara, and the Sokoto Badagri highways feature in the amendments. This is where the proposed sum of 6.222 trillion will be deployed. These are roads which cumulatively cross. 23 states and which we believe are transformational. It's divided into two, 3 trillion to recurrent and 3.2 trillion to renewed group infrastructure and critical infrastructure. No borrowing plan has been uh, identified to fund this budget. It is being funded as a result of increase in revenue. The meeting was an opportunity for lawmakers to seek insight on some other economic policies of governments. The gas revolution in terms of CNG, and we as a legislature, we also think that there should be a legal framework put in place for the implementation of this program. The funds budgeted for in the supplementary 2024 budget, is it to cover the design phase or the flag off of the construction proper? The proposed uh, 70,000, Will this proposal cover it and you have answered it? The committee asked the minister to provide more information from ministries, departments and agencies of government that would execute the projects to enable early approval of the amendments. From the National Assembly, Lami Ali, NC News.